We are back today with another... Is that a dead body? There's just a dead body laying on the ground. Oh, he ran him over. We're playing Descenders today. As you can tell by the fact that I'm currently descending off of this table, it is another Descenders video, but with a twist. I've been playing Descenders more and more and more on stream, trying to get better at it so my Descenders videos can be better. And you guys have been giving me a ton of helpful tricks and tips and just tutorials on how to, you know, further understand the game and actually get better at the game. Are you sure you don't want me to call anyone dude you I, I don't see him breathing i see absolutely no signs of life whatsoever you guys introduced me to a feature that i knew existed but i never have really used before i'm sure you can probably guess what it is from the title of the video but first oh that's not first person first person in descenders it is much less nauseating than first person in skater xl as you probably know if you've watched the first person skater xl videos definitely a mind fuck oh baby maybe kickflip crook nolly big spin Perfect. Well, kick with back tail, big spin. Wow. Because this point of view, this field of view was actually built in by the uh, the game developers, it actually works. It's still a trip. It still mind scucks me sometimes. You know, now that I actually kind of understand the game and I can clear gaps and I don't absolutely suck, I thought it could be fun to do one of these new flowy courses in first person. Okay, I do still suck. I stand corrected. You guys told me this too. You go to ride and you go to bike parks. And these are like the developer made parks that I've learned flow a lot better. Maybe it's just because I'm not that good. One of my favorite maps that you guys highly recommended in the comments that I finally got around to trying was uh, Jump City. This map is amazing. I want to start out in standard and I should just be able to flow the whole thing. Just give me a, a couple, couple attempts. Watch first try all the way. Perfect clearage on every jump. Hug it left. Ah! Cruise on down here. These are fun because you don't actually need to jump at all. All you do is float them. And it just like, because it's made by the game developers, it actually flows perfectly. Like I'm not jumping on, I'm literally just going over them, but toss a 360 in there. I feel like for how satisfying this is, just in third person, doing it in first person might be really cool, but I'm just gonna shut up and try to make the whole course without messing it up. Okay. Okay. Don't mess it up. Don't mess it up. I think there's one more jump after this. Oh, that's fine. I'm gonna get cocky, try to double back a little bit. Boom, perfect. That is, when I was making those videos titled like the most satisfying map in Descenders, that's what I had in mind. I thought that was the finish line. Let's just get into first person here and just cruise around. I have a feeling it's not gonna be easy. And we're off. I don't know. Oh boy. Did I say it wasn't nauseating? It's nauseating. I really just have to not think about it. I just gotta go. This gives me gamer neck. I'm trying to like follow my head. Perfect. 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 Oh, dude, this this spins, the spins, bleh, the spins are gnarly. Let me just try launching off this and doing a spin. 360. Is that is that what it looks like in real life? Because if you're you're riding a bike, you're doing a 360. I feel like you'd spot your landing more. I know nothing about biking. I just have I I don't know. Because I feel like you should be seeing your landing there, not landing blind but what do i know backflips make sense backflips are really fun because you can see the ground and you know exactly where you're gonna land spins are just another story <sighs> i'm releasing my inner mount I, I i really very very badly want to get into downhill mountain biking in real life this is the first step <laughs> we're starting with the video game bruise on down float these there it is i'm not gonna do any spins i'm just gonna try to get from point a to point B. We'll toss in some flips just because we can, because we're that good. Okay, I think I'm over rotating them a little bit. I said we're not doing spins, we're doing a spin. Okay. Backflip. Oh shit. Nah, that's what you would see if you if you fell. It really is kind of like a skater XL where I can only last so long in uh in first person before it just starts making me sick. Well, we take a quick intermission. I want to go explore this this course over here. Zoom on through here. Again, you don't actually see I, I, that I shouldn't even pop at all. I think this one you can really just float. So we just go. 
Okay, you know what? Maybe you have to pop a little bit. Turn. Turn. Sure. Go. Go. Go off the jump. God damn it. Yeah, I agree. Fuck it. That was that was all the break we needed. We're doing this in first person before we do it in a uh, in third person. Zoom on through here. I have no idea where we are. Oh, we're good. We're back on track. It's like once you get derailed once, and you if you don't get back on track, you're done. Should I get cocky and try to do a backup 360? I hope you said yes, cause I'm trying it. Broken neck. I I I'm, I I died. Come to my funeral, please. I'd appreciate it. Honestly, can I just cheat? Yes, this this is all fine and dandy, but I'm trying to showcase the the first person here. I need to get past the uh, the difficult parts. Starting it here. This is where the the fun flow starts. So we toss into here. I mainly just want to show off my backflip 360s because I actually learned how to do them good. So absolutely flawless two in a row. Absolutely flawless three in a row. I don't actually know what's coming up in front of me. Stay on track. Stay on track there, cowboy. You're good. We just back with 360 everything we see. Perfect. Toss one more in there just because we can. Oh, darn it. Leg, nab it. Okay, I just got to do that exact same thing, but do it in uh, in first person. Just that. That should be it. Tweaked 360 back flip. Was that it? I think that was it. It feels so different in first person. So we go back and turn. Oh, uh, that's it. I, I I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Maybe I gotta get better at 360s first. 360. Straight. Okay. Another one. Straight. I I get so disoriented in the air. I start swerving left or swerving right. The, oh, that looks so sick. Was that it? Tweak. No, that was just tweak backflip. Backflip 360. Yes. Okay, next next one I got 100%. We just clear the first one casually, because that feels really fucking cool. And then... Oh, I didn't do the spin again. What am I doing? It's just, it's so much easier in third person. The second I go in here... Oh. I guess that was it. I will admit, I stand corrected. I think that uh, just floating over jumps like that that is what's cool in first person flips and spins not so much but like this actually gives me a slight adrenaline rush <laughs> it's like skating el toro in first person skater x so oh! oh we are dead i feel like a whole new world has been opened up with these actual developer made maps rose ridge i feel like someone recommended this one so we're gonna try this one we're starting in third person i, I need to just experience oh so this is actually like a real a real trail Okay, good thing they padded that. That could have that could have ended very badly. Backflip in, cause why not? Do people do that? Like in real life, if you're right, like what what would this be classified as? Downhill trails? Like do people do flips and shit, or is that just a separate sport? All gas, no brakes. I need brakes. I need brakes. And this is a good first person map. It feels like I'm watching myself through third person through like a head mounted. Oh! Head mounted GoPro or something. Slam it on down there. Put it in reverse, Terry. You're good. Clear the rocky path of death and destruction. There you go. You're in the clear here. Nice little. What are those trees doing there? Who put those in the middle of the course? Just staring up into the heaven. Literally, when people say, don't go to the light, this is what I picture it looks like. I'm all for realism. I can use it a hundred times in all my YouTube titles. So I'm gonna, I'm putting it to use. I'm riding this as if I were actually riding this in real life. We're going slow. I'm a beginner. Don't judge me. Hold and ride in a heavy. On the brakes here. See a little straightaway. Oh, little wheelie pick up speed. Whoa! Slow it on down there. Slow it on down, boy. Okay, okay. I see this in front of me, I would stop. Me personally, I would I would turn around, walk my bike around the rocks. That's no fun. We're gonna take it very slowly and cautiously. Thread the needle through here. Okay, go around these. Wow, it really feels like I'm playing a whole different game. Like, instead of just sending it, it feels like a technical analysis game. Oh, little jumps. Just do little bunny hops. Keep it casual. Oh, shit. That's not good. We didn't die, but we were, that wasn't good. I gotta come in a little bit hotter here. I should have spotted the jump before we went, but ba-doom! 
perfect landing. But no, we're doing backflips already. We're advanced. Slow it on down. Slow it on down. Just evaluate the situation. I really, th this, the whole first person thing has made me want to actually learn how to mountain bike and downhill bike more than I ever have in my entire life. It's like all the fun of hiking, except walking seems so inefficient to me. Oh, oh, we took that one a little bit too fast now, didn't we? I think about this sometimes, because like I, I don't bike. I have an interest in biking. It's very cool to watch to me, but is is how i feel playing this how non-skaters feel playing skater xl it's like i thoroughly enjoy it but i am sure i play it like a noob and i i act like a noob because i'm a noob all right looks like a straight shot through here and then swing it left holy shit we have lost direction we didn't die take a little shortcut here yeet Oh, the, the jumps, just the straight airs are so cool in first person to me. That's what I imagine it feels like. I mean, probably more fun, but like, you know what I'm saying. This goes on for, ow! This does go on for a bit longer than I expected. So how, like in real life, how do you get up? Do you have to ride up or do you like park your car up and then ride down and get a, uh, and get like a lift back up? I'm very intrigued by this sport. I really am. Where is the end? We are going into fog. I see nothing. We're sending it. Maximum speed. No mercy. We're launching. We don't even know where the end is. Backflip. Best case scenario. Whee! I think this is the end. We're doing it. We're doing the backflip three. We're going. We're not. Moving on. It is time, ladies and gentlemen. The time has come. If we are playing in first person, it's only fair that we play the one, the only, Super Ultra Mega Park from Skate 3. I was so hyped when I finally found this map in Descenders and I had never even thought about riding it in first person because I didn't really know about first person. Oh, wow. Sometimes it feels so right and sometimes it doesn't work with my brain. Pop. Like I should be spotting my landing earlier, I think. Cause I, I, it's like I'm going into every turn blind, but when it works, it feels so sick. And then it doesn't, and then it doesn't. I just realized I haven't done any like tricks. I'm gonna try to do like a, oh, I did a 360 knack knack, but you couldn't even tell. This would be the spot to do flips and spins. That's, it. see that, that made sense. I think I did a 180 backflip. That kind of felt like it should, cause you can see, oh my God. You can see where you're going kind of. There's no way I'm clearing that. I cleared it. Yeah. Those feel so cool. And now we're dead, broken neck. Should not have gone for a double. Meow. 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 Oh, I feel like a mountain biker. Meow. Meow. Boo. Meow. Boo. Oh, we landed a flat. Go, 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 go. It's like being a little kid and playing with Hot Wheel cars again. You like, you need sound effects. It just makes it that much better. All right, what about instead of a flip, just uh, what, 720 would it be? No, let me figure it out in third person. So we'd go, yeah, that's a, oh, it's a five. Oh yeah, that makes sense. So it's just maximum turn. Go, spot it there. Yeah, right? Ah! It's like, it, it, I'm having just as much fun as it is making me sick inside. I feel like the best way to learn is to do tricks in third person for it. Cause I've been doing this flip 180. And those actually make sense. Cause you're upside down looking at your landing. So it's like flip spot, your landing, turn it. And I always land a flat on that one. Go! Oh, that's fine. And then kind of not at all. How do I do a no hander again? I wonder if that looks different. Ooh. Oh, yeah, you can kind of see it. Ooh. 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 Okay. Okay. We're clearing it. Barely. No hander 180. Barely. I always get lost here because I cannot clear these huge humpty wumpties. I want to see what the, uh, the big gap looks like. First, let me do it in third person just to feel it out. Okay, just a little double backflip. That's why we feel it out first. Luckily, I'm not, I, I, I didn't go in first person. Would've been bad. One, two. Oh, darn it. Single to get warmed up. 
cleared it perfectly. Try popping it earlier. That should be it. Oh! 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 That was that felt really sick. I, I could do this all day. I'm having too much fun with this. Spin. I'm like, oh, I, I was about to say, I'm starting to understand that I just fucking die. It's almost clicking in my head how to spot the landing, so I'm dead. Uh, almost. There's no like control to move my uh, head. Cause that'd be so sick. Cause the way that I picture, like, hear me, hear me out. You're riding your bicycle, right? You you have, you have your handlebars grasp. You're doing a 360. So you're gonna look over to initiate the rotation. You look over. You start spinning. You start spinning here, right here. You you're spotting the ground. You're still going this way, but you're spotting it, and then you bring it in. That's like what I. I'm so tangled in my cords right now. I'm genuinely very curious. Ooh, no hander backflips look sick. We're doing it. No hander double back. No hand double back. Oh, victory! I'm calling it. I'm calling it there. We're ending on a good note. I'm really genuinely curious to see how it compares in real life. Cause I know in Skater XL, obviously it's not the same as real life, but it's oddly accurate. I'd be curious to hear from someone that actually, you know, bikes, whether it's downhill or mountain biking or whatever. But if it's, if it compares at all, 720. No, no chance of survival. <gasps> I'm done. Thumbs up the video. Every single thumbs up helps. It is very refreshing. I've been doing a lot of Skater XL lately. It feels good to play something else. I mentioned this on stream today, actually. But, you know, I, I, I love action sports. It is my passion both in real life and in video games. But I'm more than open to trying a new genre of games, whether it's, you know, first person shooters or just kind of whatever. I'm open to it. Let me know in the comments down below if you have a game that you think would be fun for me to play and like preferably not FPS just because like I don't I, I, I don't think that would be good content. I'm just bad. Like I, I want it to be something that, you know, my personality could shine through on. Oh, I will see you guys on stream today. I will see you guys on this channel tomorrow. And I'm doing a no-hander 180. Ending the video. Peace out.